FTC looking to rein in data collection, a piece of presidential maritime history, and your Monday pick. Arbitrage State of the Bands Daily starts right now. Good morning, traders. Here's your Arbitrage State of the Bands Daily for Monday, August 15, 2022. I'm Joshua Stark. Whether it's the fitness tracker on your wrist, the smart home appliances in your house, or your latest kids fad going viral in online videos, they all produce a trove of personal data for big tech companies. How that data is being used and protected has led to growing public concern and officials outrage. And now federal regulators are looking to draft rules to crack down on what they call harmful commercial surveillance and lax data security. The FTC announced the initiative Thursday seeking public comment on the effects of companies' data collection. More after this on Arbitrage State of the Bands Daily. Why was the basketball court all wet? Because the players kept dribbling on it. (laughs) The dad joke. Corny, groan-worthy, but also one of the simplest ways to share a moment with your kids. What did the buffalo say when he dropped his son off for school? Bye, son. So take a moment to make your kid laugh, because dad jokes rule. Make your kid laugh today. Go to fatherhood.gov. Brought to you by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services and the Ad Council. A private shipyard is preparing for a painstaking stem to stern restoration of a floating piece of presidential history. The Sequoia is a 1925 motor yacht that served eight presidents before being sold by President Jimmy Carter in 1977. French and Webb, a custom boat building company, was tapped for the restoration by the current owner. Strict guidelines must be followed because the vessel is on the National Register of Historic Places. It's slowly happening, but the needle is moving, Todd French told the Bangor Daily News. Your Monday Pick, a specialty pharmaceutical company, focuses on the acquisition, development, and commercialization of prescription products for hospital acute care, gastroenterology, rheumatology, and oncology in the United States and internationally. Cumberland Pharmaceuticals, symbol CPIX, starts at two fifty one a share. Have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. I'm 54, so it's too late to start saving for retirement, right? Uh, not right. Starting to save, even in your 50s, can really make a difference. Right now, saving seems hard to wrap my head around. AARP makes it easy. Go to aceyourretirement.org and chat with Avo, the friendly digital retirement coach. It's free and only takes three minutes. I like three minutes. Answer some questions and get personalized tips to help boost your retirement savings. Thanks. Just head to aceyourretirement.org. That's aceyourretirement.org. A message from AARP and the Ad Council. Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, is a privately held market research company. Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, is solely responsible for the preparation and distribution of the content of this podcast. The opinions offered in this podcast are for informational purposes only and are not intended to be investment advice. Seek a duly licensed professional for investment advice. For more information about the informational research and services offered by Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, please visit Arbitrage trade.com.